Hey y'all, so let's get right into this video. So today I'm gonna be sharing with you my wash day routine on my TWA, on my big chop, on sharp natural hair. So today I'm using Girl and Hair Water to Foam Shampoo and the Pattern Beauty Treatment Mask. So I'm just gonna cleanse my hair really nicely and I like to use this Lux Therapy hair pick to really get down to the roots in my scalp. Now using the Pattern Beauty Treatment, I'm gonna put that all over my hair like really like slather it in there and then use a plastic cap plus a thermal conditioning cap to deep condition for 20 minutes now using the Mish sculpt curl defining gel i might say that this is not what i typically use but i'm using it today because um i just recently bought it honestly not my favorite in terms of the way it goes into my hair and just feels really, really sticky and doesn't have lots of slip, but whatever. So to really get down to the technique, that's what I'm focusing on. I'm using my three row comb to basically flip my hair up. That's what I'm doing and I'm taking my fingers to kind of sandwich the curls in between and roll it onto my finger as if it's like a roller or something like that, like a rod. So that's how I get the most definition out of my curls in terms of like how short it is. Um, this is what I do with my clients and I do it on myself. Also ignore the uh, red patch on my neck. That is my lovely psoriasis coming through. Um, yeah, so that's what, I, that's what I'm doing right now. Like all over my head up until I get to the top part, that's what I do. Now when my hair starts to get longer, this is where I can shingle it. Right now I'm applying product. And then I'm taking my mini Denman brush and I am doing the same thing as I would do with the three row comb, just defining and detangling. By the way, everything that I use in this video is gonna be in the description box below with links for your reference. Now for the rest of my hair at the top, I'm gonna use my shingling method that I love and y'all know me for. This is the best way to get the most movement and the most definition out of my curls. Once again, this is a technique that I use on both myself and on my clients because I feel like it is definitely a technique that is good for all textures um, from type four all the way to the loosest waves. So I love this technique. Um, I find that this works best on dense to medium hair. Fine hair, you can definitely get away with using a comb or a brush, but this is the way for dense to medium hair. Now for the baby hairs. This is the star of the show, y'all. I'ma kinda give y'all a little toot on this, but <laughs> just let me know down below if y'all wanna see like an in-depth tutorial. This is how I do my waves though. And I wanna shout out Anastasia at Baby Bangs in New Orleans for showing me how to do this, the swirls. It's, all, it's, it's the vibe, y'all. This is a vibe. So I'm just using the Mish Sculpt Defining Gel for this. Um, I have to say that I don't like the consistency in terms of the gel, but I do love the hold. And this is a perfect gel for baby hairs and for someone who's looking for a firm hold in their wash and go. So boom, bam, pow. This is how it's looking. And after I sat under the dryer, let me tell y'all, for 30 minutes, this gel dries very, very fast. 30 minutes, okay? I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna apply some oil to my hair to break that gel cast and to soften my uh, curls. I don't do too, too much on day one because if you don't over manipulate your day one curls, they're gonna last a lot longer. I know we all love big hair, but <laughs> chill out. So I'm taking a little, um, you know, a little pick or whatever, and I'm just picking my roots a little bit. So that concludes the video. This is my wash day far short natural hair let me know in the comments down below what you'd like to see next on my hair and don't forget to comment rate subscribe and leave all of the love in the comments down below until next time